Hello! Morning! So we woke up, worked out, <sighs> and now we're gonna go get some breakfast. We're just gonna go to the Bubu Warung, probably get some like avocado toast, and then we're gonna go to the Monkey Forest today and try not to get our stuff stolen. Yeah. <laughs> Delicious avocado toast. All right, we smashed our avocado toast, moving on. We're gonna go high five the villa, grab a couple extra things, and then head to the forest. The forest of monkeys. Which costs like five bucks each to get in. At least I hope the price is still the same. That's what it cost us last time. Back at the villa. All right, we got our stuff. Onward. I keep on wanting to Tarzan this low hanging root ball whenever we walk by here. It'd probably collapse on me instantly. Right, grab it right on the ground. So this is the traffic-filled road that we usually end up traveling along to get to the monkey forest. We're just about to ditch to the new shortcut that we found, or at least the, the back way where there's a lot less people. More school kids though, because we noticed that there's a school up here. And here's our exit from the shortcut right onto Monkey Forest Road. I'm like maybe 50 meters from the uh, entrance to the monkey forest. So we did good but still five bucks a person, which is pretty good for what this park is. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, little guy, where's your mommy? That's right, just scratch your butt. Yeah, to give you some kind of idea, there is lots of monkeys here, and this is just the entrance. That would make sense as to why they call it the monkey forest. But there's also nice, like, intricate carvings and whatnot in here. Just pleasantly enjoying some, some apple. Looks like he doesn't like me filming him so much. I'm surprised that he's not getting like ransacked. Oh, he's getting a knife. A monkey went to reach for it and he just kind of tapped the monkey's head with the knife. Yeah, he's gonna keep on scaring off the monkeys. Oh, he stole a whole one. Good job. He's a good catch. Oh, you missed that one. Yeah, he's pretty good. Yeah, so last time we were here, there was a bunch of people selling bananas. Yeah. But I don't think they're doing that anymore. It seems to be that they're like putting them in cages and then rationing out the monkeys. Maybe they had issues with like tourists getting attacked or something like that. I wouldn't be surprised. Well, I got robbed by a monkey before for the bananas. Right. Yeah, yeah you did. Yeah, so these are the guidelines of the monkey forest once again. Don't look them in the eye, watch your stuff. Don't touch the babies, then don't feed them. Now, last time we were here, there was a monkey that was like, he was blind and he was segregated into a cage by himself. We're gonna see if we can find him, see if he's still here. We felt bad for the guy, but I guess it was just so that he didn't, you know, injure himself or get injured by others. Yeah, it was more for his safety. Okay, there we go. There's the, the English version of these signs. Do not ever touch, grab, or disturb the monkeys, especially baby monkeys. They may touch you, but please do not ever touch them because their reactions are unpredictable. Baby monkeys may seem harmless, but their mothers are very defensive of them. The monkeys seem like a little playful around here. They're all running around. Well, I thought that this guy was gonna try to like mate with that other monkey. He looks like a, a jacked monkey too. But this one looked like she was into him. Now she's like following him and being like, chirp. Oh no, he's, he's totally banging another monkey. <laughs> and I'm spent. Um, okay. <laughs> this seems to be the spot for monkey banging. So many monkeys. Yeah, because they're all banging. This guy's just sliding down the tree. Love it. With a baby in tow. What's this guy trying to do with the big stick? Oh, he's running away with the stick. And now he's chewing on it. <laughs> just hauling away his stick. I'm kind of surprised we've been here this long and the monkeys haven't tried to cook with us yet. That's fine with me. It's because we don't have food. The bigger monkey was like giving me the eye when I started walking closer. Yeah, some of them don't like us filming them or taking photos. No. Which is fine. I just didn't want to get too close because he just kind of like, what you doing? Nelson looks like he's going down for a little nap. But yeah, this is the, the blind monkey that we saw last time in the cage. Seems like little monkeys can get inside and and play with them a little now. I don't know if they do or if they try to screw with them or what. But yeah, poor guy, he's doing okay. Yeah, see, look, his eyes are a little weird looking. Seems to be okay, other than that he wants a nap. Nope, nope. Yeah, no, he was interested in you. Yeah, nope. Sorry, that's what I say no. He was trying to show himself the monkey in the phone. 
with the monkeys will play uh, touch screen games. I think these guys are friends. <laughs> Can you do me a favor and fix my hair for me? And maybe eat the lice off my face? Where is it? Give me that lice. Yeah. I can't find any. at you. A little mohawk. Oh, hey, buddy. Here comes the hop. Oh, yeah. Good hop, buddy. Oh, he's even got a baby. This forest is gorgeous. Everybody's doing their photo ops here. Look at this guy just lazing about. Oh, you tired? Is it nap time? Well, this guy managed to steal something. It looks like a change purse. It does look like a change purse. He's gonna find out that there's nothing in it that yeah, he wants. You can't do that. Smash! Smash, smash, smash! smash. smash. You got a nice little mohawk. I love their mohawk. See, this monkey's smart. He's just hanging out in the gazebo in the shade with Jamie, taking some pictures of him. He's ready for his photo shoot. Right. He looks bored. My favorite is when they sit the balls just kind of... Oh yeah, no, his nuts are freaking giant. Where are you picking off your feet? Some weird feet. What are these guys doing? Yeah, get off me. Oh! <laughs> Jesus! What's your problem? Got, he got on me. Finally got attacked by a monkey. Oh my god. <laughs> he was just a little guy at least. Yeah, but it scared me so much. He like jumped on the back of my head. Are you trying to break it open? So here's a, a scooter path right beside the monkey forest. And uh... Yeah, some monkeys just hanging out over top of people. Wonder if they ever like jump on scooters driving by and try to hitch a ride. And of course, there's people stopped. Well, this guy's nice and relaxed, getting groomed. It's just grooming his nuts. Ugh. These monkeys are not happy with each other. And this is right at the entrance. Yeah. All right, we are exiting. <laughs> We're gonna exchange some money. It's a little bit better of a raid today. Oh, we actually get reds, hooray. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh, Google Maps, look at that. I know what we could do, we could go to Grandpa's for a burger. Grandpa's is a spot that we went to last time when we were here, and they probably had the best burger that we had here. But really, at some point, I have to try this. The Indonesian street food. It's gonna happen at some point. And this is what we get. An actual decent sized burger with an egg on it, with some ABC ketchup and fries. And Jamie got like a pulled pork sammy. So I think we're gonna be terrible people and go for a Dairy Queen milkshake after this. So that's 92,000 for two milkshakes, which is like half of lunch. And now we march back home with milkshakes. Back and showered, sitting here editing. It's getting dark outside. There's a Jamie. And we noticed that uh, the uh, the pooper has returned because he's around at like the the same time every night, and we've got his uh, his poop pad all uh, set up for him. Let's see if he manages to hit it again. He's hit it like maybe what five six days in a row now. Yeah, no, he's been good. He needs a name. What do you think we should name him? Poopy McPooperson. <laughs> All over his leg first. No, it wasn't real. We're gonna like move down a little bit more. I'm gonna stick his butt out. Every time I like hear it hit the table, I look up and he's kind of more down, but his butt's kind of hanging off the thing. Okay. That's, that's it. I'm gonna see if I can get the tripod and set it up. All right, you are clear for pooping. <laughs> Looks 
sorry about that. Both those geckos seem to do their business on the pad. Seems we have successfully potty trained two geckos. So proud. So just as we were remarking that we had potty trained them, Jamie just got shot <gasps> up. I got shot up by a gecko. It's supposed to be good luck in Balinese culture. No! <laughs> and there's the culprit. Wandered over to make sure they pooped right on Jamie. Oh my goodness. Good night, buddy.